And Donald Trump is going to be more of an organizer. I think people like uh, Petraeus will be more like uh, Secretary of Defense or the Army or whatever, whatever. And he'll probably use Romney as a Secretary of State or some high position. Uh, it's the old thing, you, you keep your friends close and your adversaries even closer. So I think that's what he'll probably do. And people like Christie, who are problem people, uh, he's going to kind of distance himself. Uh, the old trick of... Um, uh, what makes a good boss or a good manager is not how much they know. It, it's how they uh, are you uh, capable of being good at human resources. Uh, they put the right people in the right places and, and they manage them. Uh, I think that's why uh, Trump seems to be bored at different meetings and things. He he want, he'll have people to answer to him. And he doesn't want to be an expert at everything. That's This is what I feel. I feel he wants to manage them and run it that way. That's the way uh, somebody like him usually runs things. They, they, they know how to get the right people. They put them in place. The people answer to them. And they don't have their nose in everything. The more you micromanage, the less you really manage because you're too busy looking over somebody's shoulder to, to really see the big picture. And and I don't think most people understand this. The politicians uh, uh, were managing things and, and look at the mess that got created. We wind up owing money to different countries. We lost our manufacturing. And the old thing about like somebody like uh, Henry Ford who wanted to sell a car to the average person, and he wanted the average person that worked for him to be able to afford the car. Uh, visionaries like this were lost in the shuffle as people just worried about being reelected and, and taking care of their own cronies. And uh, we hope that cronyism uh, at this point will be eliminated with good management. We hope that uh, Trump is what I, I hope his numbers say he'll be. He has the capability of doing a great thing, but like I said, George Washington, I don't think he was weak, and I don't think he was... Uh, I don't know if he chopped down a ch cherry tree, but he, he did put the country together. And and I think this is what we need again. We, we don't need a politician. We need somebody to really conduct the government like a, a well-oiled machine, a, like a well-oiled business to make it successful. So don't worry if he has his nose and everything as long as he has the right people there and they, and they make the right decisions. Uh, the, this is the way it should go. Uh, not micromanagement, but management.